Hello, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to record a SoundCloud file and then take that recording and embed it into a Weebly website. This is great if you're wanting to add narration to existing content in your website. The first thing you need to do is create a SoundCloud account and I've already done that and I'm logged in so this is the home page and what I need to do is get to a, a screen that allows me to record um, a new sound so it seems kind of strange but I'm going to come over here to this button that says upload and, and you'll see why in just a second when I click upload I come to a window that basically shows me two options. I can record my own voice or choose a file to upload. So that's why it says that. I'm going to go ahead and click the record button. And just an FYI, you may see a window pop up that asks you to um, confirm that you're going to use Adobe Flash settings. If you do need to say allow and then save that in order to record. You actually have to push this button twice to get your recording to happen. Today, we're talking about SoundCloud and how to record a SoundCloud file and embed it into a Weebly website. So I click the button again to stop my recording. And if you look down at the bottom, you can see the sound waves. And if you look at the bottom of the sound waves, it says upload your recording. This is actually going to upload my sound file to my account. Think of this, at those of you that use YouTube, think of it as your YouTube channel. Well, now you have a SoundCloud channel too. And all of your tracks um, are available to you in your account. So I'm going to go ahead and just finish this off by giving it a title. I'll just use SoundCloud sample. I can even upload an image if I want to, um, add a description, say what type of recording it is, um, put in a genre and add tags. One thing you want to make sure is that your SoundCloud file is public, otherwise it won't work when you go to embed it into a website. So I'm just going to scroll down here to click save. I don't need to do anything else. When I do that, it's actually going to take me to another window that will show me the SoundCloud, um, the SoundCloud sample that I created. And then it gives me some choices here. I can like it, so favorite it or like it. I can add it to a set, which helps me organize my sounds. Um, I can also add it to a group. I can share it, which is what we're going to be doing here in a minute. I can go back and edit it, or I can delete it. So let's just go ahead and play this SoundCloud sample just to make sure it works. Today, we're talking about SoundCloud and how to record a SoundCloud file and embed it into a Weebly website. Sounds like it works to me. So let's go ahead and click on that share button. And we're going to see a window pop up that says um, widget code. This is your embed code to create a widget in your website. So I'm just going to click inside that box. It automatically highlights all the text that I need. So I'm going to use my keyboard shortcuts here. Command C on the Mac, Control C on a Windows to copy that embed code. Now I'm going to jump to my website because I'm ready to paste that code in. This is a website I use um, to provide different instruction on a website. So uh, it's a Weebly website. I'm going to just scroll down here a little bit until I've, I'm in the area that says drag elements here. And what I need is I need a custom HTML element. So I'm just going to drag that down to my page. When it's in the place where it needs to be, it will say click to set custom HTML. So I will click there and paste. Command V on a Mac, Control V on a Windows. I want you to notice that there's a little blue um, box that popped up and it allows me to align my widget um, left, center, or right, but this is going to fill the screen, so I'm going to go ahead and leave it as is. I'm going to click outside of the box, and there is my um, embed code now showing up as a widget. So I'm going to go ahead and publish this page and let's take a look at it live. What would people see that were visiting our web page? What does it look like for them? So I'll go to the correct page here. Oops.
and you can see there's my widget sound, SoundCloud sample uh, easy for me to say today we're talking about SoundCloud and how to record a sound so there you go those are the steps on how to add an audio narrative into your Weebly website using a tool called SoundCloud.